Hi guys, I hope everyone's having a great day. Today I'm gonna be playing with the Jawbreaker palette by Jeffree Star. I've already done my brows and put some concealer and base on my eyelids prior to starting this video. And the first shade I'm going in with is that yellow shade. I should have the palette next to me, but I don't, so I apologize for that. But I will put them in the link in the information or description below. I did go ahead and order my ring light. It will be here tomorrow, so I'm super excited about that. Quality of my videos and photos will be so much better. Um, please go ahead and subscribe. I'll also leave my Instagram and Twitter handles in the description as well. So I was super excited to play with this palette. This is the first look that I created with it and I think it, it was really fun to create and it came out really, really, really good. Better than what I thought. <laughs> I'm still learning how to make all of these or create these, you know, bright colored looks and crazy looks. I usually just do one or two colors on my eyes, but I like to get creative. So next I'm going in with pink. And originally when I looked at the palette and I was just looking around at all of the colors, I just looked at a few of the colors that were next to each other and it reminded me of My Little Pony. So originally that's what my inspiration was i don't i think at the end that changed but um yeah that's where i got my inspiration to get for the colors from after the pink i am going in with purple and trying to create the shape around the outer corner of my eye all of these colors are above my crease. This palette, the colors were super pigmented. I loved it and I can't wait to create another look. Okay, so here I've applied some dark blue the outer corner and I'm just blending it in and this was um, the outer corner lid and crease as well and just blend 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 at this point I still didn't know how this look was going to turn out I was a little nervous but I had my poker face on <laughs> I really liked how my brows came out today, on this day. So next I am going in with Brain Freeze and that was like one of my favorite colors in the palette. That's why I remember what, exactly the name of it. But um, I'm going into the inner lid. I've teared up and blending it outward towards the navy blow. Yellow is really in the summer. I think the next look I create is going to have a lot of yellow in it. Just going back over with the navy blue to deepen it a little more, add some more depth. All 
right, so at this point, I was leaving my eyes alone after I did some blending. And now it's time to focus on the face. And we'll come back to the eyes after. Of course, I'm using Julia's Place I Am Magic Foundation. Full coverage foundation that I really, really love. I really need to order the concealer that goes along with this foundation. I have not used that yet, and I would like to review that for sure. I did, however, place an order today, a few orders today, and I will be doing a haul video as soon as I get my shipments in. I'm really excited about it, but I'm not going to ruin the surprise. Checking out those corners. <laughs> Alright, now I'm going to go in with some color on the bottom of the lid or the lower lid. And so we're going to take that from the uh, outer corner to the center of the lower lid. And I'm just dragging that color outward just to make it a little bit dramatic. Next, I'm going to go in with one of the red shades. It was actually like an orange shade, I'm sorry. And then I went in with the color orange juice. Alright, and for my inner tear duct, I'm going to be using the color Lemon Drop, which is another one of my favorite colors, that's why I remember the name. Um, like I literally, like this color is so beautiful and so pigmented and it just, oh, it's just beautiful. It's like yellow with golden flecks in it, it's amazing. I'm 
this palette is a lot of fun there's just so many looks that can be created with it um there's there's a lot there's a lot you love to mess with color or even if you don't love to mess with color but you would like to test it out i definitely recommend this palette I'm still just kind of looking at myself and just looking at how the look was coming out. So next I decided that I wanted to make the look a little bit unique and I took one of my really tiny brushes and all I did was like dip it into, um, press it against one of the red shades and I made freckles across my face. I really liked the outcome of this and don't know what made me think to do it, but um, I, I feel like it gave it my own unique twist. But it definitely made the look look sweeter. <laughs> Next, I'm going to go in with my Moon Girl Lashes, and these lashes are called Pisces, and they are beautiful. I highly recommend Moon Girl Lashes. Um, I've used these lashes several times, and they still look perfect as if I just opened the box. Oh, whoops, I got ahead of myself. I guess I was just looking for the box of lashes, but... Next, I'm going in with my Revolution Bronzer. Add some color to this face, other than the color I already have on my eyes. Blush. And of course, my Kylie Cosmetics highlighter. And this is in the shade Ice Me Out. This is my first time using this fan brush. I don't, I'm not really a fan of it. Um, I think I'm gonna stick with my regular highlighter brushes, the thicker ones, but um. So I'm just blending out some more because I'm not used to using this fan brush, but I think it looks okay. It wasn't that bad and I didn't want to ruin the freckles. Um, I decided to go with the fuchsia colored lipstick to go along with this look. No lip liner, but I think that it came out just fine and it matched the look perfectly. This lipstick was just a wet and wild lipstick. Again, um, you can always inbox me if you really want to know uh, the brand and the name but here's a finished look and I've put on my moon girl lashes I think it came out great I loved it and it was really fun creating this look hi guys um, so I am gonna post a video on this look or be connected with one with this one but really quickly I just wanted to say today I made this look using the jawbreaker palette I love this palette. I love, love, love this palette. Thank you, Jeffrey. Thank you, Jeffrey Star Cosmetics. This palette, oh my god. I can't. My new fave. 
um, pigmented, pigmentation, sorry, oh my God, out of this world. And I just, I can't wait to create other looks with this. I feel like, like this palette, I even obviously used to make like these little freckles on my face and you can just do so much given you have like, you know, the right brushes and, and then the right tools that you need. But just with this palette alone, eyeshadow, lips, face, everything everything like oh amazing i love it um i i kind of wanted to do some swatches on it uh oh and i rarely i didn't really notice any fallout with this palette uh i love it because it has a huge mirror for one okay you can feel it is not cheap packaging at all and when it came in the package it came wrapped in like gift wrap gift wrap paper with like the pink stars on it um and in white and pink and oh, it's just so pretty it was just like just like a gift i loved it and i had like the little sticker seal oh my gosh super super cute um then the palette actually came in this box here which is also really cute that's why i kept it as well <laughs> um but yeah and i it even like kind of bends back like that so um yeah it's really great packaging i love this palette like i just i can't stop saying it i love this palette oh anyway <laughs> so i actually got this look um when i i just kept looking at the palette when i got it because it was just i was so excited and there's just so many possibilities that i was kind of overwhelmed and i was like uh let me take a day to sit and think on this um this look i kind of i'll tell you exactly kind of how i got to it it kind of took a different turn a little but i'll show you so maybe i'll create a look more like what i was thinking another day but i was just staring like at the yellow at this pink purple i know i wanted to use brain freeze as one of my first you know in in my first look um i looked at this color and it kind of reminded me of my little pony <laughs> So, um, when I did the, excuse the sunlight, I'm trying to move, um, when I did the yellow and the pink and the purple, like, that was the kind of, um, the inspiration that I had behind that. I feel like my look, it still gives me My Little Pony vibes, um, but then I just, I mean, it's just, it was really cute, and that's why I decided to add the freckles. I, I wanted to do something different, um... I was kind of, I didn't see that many uh, YouTube videos, not as many as, I, I guess because, you know, that everybody just got their palettes not that long ago, except for those who are on PR. Um, there wasn't that many looks on there for me to look at that I, not any that I actually was like, oh, I kind I want to do it. I want to do it. Like, I was like, well, why not just think of my own, right? So, because, um, you know, usually I like to go on YouTube and sometimes I look at, because I'm just starting out, I look at other people's looks and I either try to recreate it or I I look at it and I take some things, but then I kind of give it my own twist. 